And something something cool about me, Miss Hammond? All right. Yes. All right, so something that's really cool and unique about who I am is that I am transgender. So we touched a little bit about that at the beginning of this week uh, in the book that Miss Hammond read, but I'm going to give you my explanation about what it means to be transgender as well. So when babies are born, the doctor looks at them and they make a guess about whether the baby is a boy or a girl based on what they look like. And most of the time, that guess is 100% correct. There are no issues whatsoever. Um, and, but sometimes the doctor is wrong. The doctor makes an incorrect guess. Um, when the doctor makes a correct guess, that's when a person is called cisgender. When a doctor's guess is wrong, that's when they are transgender. So I'm a man. But when I was a baby, the doctors told my parents I was a girl. And so my parents gave me a name that girls typically have and bought me clothes that girls typically wear. Um, and until I was 18 years old, everyone thought I was a girl. And this was super, super uncomfortable for me because I knew that wasn't right. Um, the way I like to describe it is like wearing a super itchy sweater. Um, the longer you wear it, the itchier it gets, and the only way to make the itching stop is to have everyone see and know the person that you really are. So when I was 18, I told my family and my friends that I'm really a boy, and it was like this huge weight had been lifted off of my shoulders, and I had the freedom to be who I truly am. And even though this experience is super challenging sometimes, um, I am it made me the person I am, and I'm super proud to be transgender.